Hi, I'm Jen Zielinski at Zip Zone in Peachland. It's actually the third year in a row I've been able to cover this wonderful event where women literally put their life on the line and bear it all in an effort to raise money for breast cancer research. We're going to go inside and check out the annual Bear in the Air event. Over the last four years, we've raised $50,000. Today, the count is $12,000. Wow. For five years, women from around the Okanagan have been dangling more than 300 feet in the air, freeing themselves from the worry of body issues, judgment, and the fear of the unknown. They come together as a sisterhood. They've either battled breast cancer themselves or know someone who has. I, we've all been affected by cancer. I lost my husband to cancer 13 years ago. Not breast cancer, but I was widowed very young. And uh, I'm here to support the breast cancer fundraiser. And yourself? I lost my mom and my aunt to cancer, so. Of course, we've all been affected by people with cancer, and um, I have a number of people, including little two-year-old who has actually done that fight. And so those people inspire me. We come in and we're naked with like all these women, total strangers, but everyone's so happy and you know, there's no judgment or anything. It's great, yeah. My mom is a breast cancer survivor and she's had a mastectomy and she's one year cancer free. And since she started, I've been doing all kinds of different things for breast cancer. All kinds of things, which includes zip lining naked. But as much fun as flying through the air can be, it's the stories of survival that really brings these women together. Mm, a mother of five children, good family, fun, and then cancer hits. Wow, what a life-changing alteration. I've suffered it, I've lived it, I'm free of it today. Today I'm free of it, and that's all I'm going with. Some of the ladies here have actually had surgeries and so some of them are facing sort of body image issues and things like that and to come here and to a certain extent be liberated and there's a, there's a real sense of sisterhood around here. This year the event was put on by Babes in Business, bold authentic babes with exceptional standards and this is about as bold and authentic as you can get. Being able to jump in this way and to express yourself and to just let those fears go, like when you jump off that platform, you're letting go of so much. And so you think about all these women who have had to let go of so many things to heal. There's such an alignment in that. So we, we really stand behind that as babes. It was amazing. Actually, I felt kind of free coming back. Awesome. It's very safe. It's not what everybody thinks. It's good weather, so it all comes out in the end. 28 women participated in the day and pretty much all said they would be returning next year. For Castanet News, I'm Jen Zielinski.